So now let's integrate Firebase into TRPC. To be precise, what I mean is let's integrate Firestore APIs into TRPC endpoints. For that, we need to import a few things from the sample git request file. Here, Firestore from the config file, git docs and collection from Firestore. Then we have to create a configuration here. Let me do it here. Sample collection, fired store, sample. Okay. Now we have to use this sample collection, collection name, into this get docs function. So let me grab this thing. And let me remove this greeting endpoint. Just have the get user. Fine. Now, in this query here, let me add this. We don't need this res status 200 because that's not needed here. Now we have this sample get request here with the get docs that is getting the data from the Firestore. But the thing is the scope of this users array should be outside. So just move it outside get docs here. Now we will return this users. So just copy this and return it like this. I mean in the parenthesis. So we don't need Zord here. So remove this Zord. Fine. Now let's check the console. But will it work? Get user.use query. This will call this function and let's see what happens. We have the object here with the data and inside we're getting another object. But you will see that the user's array is empty because we are not getting the data properly. To fix that, we have to make the function as asynchronous. So make async in the query and await the get docs function. Save this and if you now check or give it a refresh, this will work. We will get data, an object and array of users from the fire store. If we are doing this, then we don't need sample get function to delete this. Fine. Now we have done this. Okay. Now what should we do? We have integrated the get users here. Let me also add one more called post users, which will be also public procedure and all. So let me just grab these things and add it here. Let me remove all the code from inside and add one curly bracket. Then one small bracket. So in this, we will add a add data in the collection. So let me open Fired Store. This LinkedIn clone app. Okay, it's it loaded. It's getting loaded. We have sample. So if we add data, this will be inside this collection. So how can we add data? If you open the post or sample post, we are getting the name and email, email and password, sorry, from request.body.email and password. I mean from the body. Then we are using add doc to add data and returning us the user. So we will use something called mutation if we are using a post request here. So let me open mm, this. What is it? Uh, TRPC. This starter kit from Stack Blitz. In here we had a function which is okay. Greeting we had. We had the get user. Okay, as you see that it is taking the input and printing it in the console so to get the input we will use this input from the public procedure so let me just remove these things first add the input okay like this so we need let me just grab the greeting function okay i think this is from here to here Greeting, yes, just review it, just replace this. 
now this will be known as post users we have to import z from zord for the types so import z from zord i know errors now we have here so let me remove the comments so we are getting a name from here that we will pass where we will call the api but we need two things email and name sorry email and password not name and both will be strings so let me just add this here as well fine now to store the data let me also remove this text fine so how do we add data let me open the trpc uh, documentation quick start backend usage define router define procedures okay yes we will use mutation or we can also do this let me go to my github account then i had a repo that i used trpc before in that repo which is called note taker application let me see this refer this from here so source oh, this is new source pages api trpc okay i guess not here maybe in the server it has it is server api routers let's try node.ts here we have the get all to get data and then we have create one to create so let me just use the existing one create one is here which will be a public procedure we are not we have not added private so we don't need the prisma things just remove the return and return some empty string here fine so save this we will have post let's say sample fine which is a public procedure it will take three things so title not title i mean two things sorry email which will be a string comma password password also a string z dot string save this what is this in mutation we are getting the data let me add the data here data which is or which has one sec return data or not like this maybe okay we have to add the post request here like add doc so but first let me make a object so in object we will like email as input dot email okay not do, uh, not comma dot then also the same in the password hmm now we have to return the data as users so add a curly bracket return data or maybe user but we also need to use add doc to add data to the fire store so add it here we have to import add doc so i import it here fine so this user what is the ctx it's context okay we don't need ctx we only need input so we will mutate the email and the password then we will send the user to the sample collection and return the user fine fine then now we can call let's try this let me call this public procedure which is post sample where we have the form so close this maybe we had the form in pages auth sorry not pages index where did we had it i think in components we had input 
we have API. Where is the login page? That okay. In auth. So slash auth slash login. Okay, a client site error. What is the error? If you check auth, then login. Okay. L should be capital. So make it L as capital. Enter. One sec. L O G I N. What is the problem? I think in the index we need to import this. Yes. Or maybe not because login is just a page. So pages slash auth slash login. Why it's not working? We are exporting this function. Okay, this should be not home, this should be login. Now I think it will work. If I make LS capital. Oh no, 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 not this. Go back. L should be capital. It's reverting it back to small. Maybe we have to change it here. Login. Yes, now it's working. We have this firefly.js which email and the password. So if I submit this, if I run the submit function, handle submit, this will post data to the server. So to use this, we need to call this use query. So if I check the note taker, we have create one. So if I come to index.tsx, do we have create one? Yes, here api.topic.create1.use mutation, use mutation. So let me come here in this result and okay in the post miss in the login page we need let me just comment out these things fine so in here let me just cut this paste it but instead of api we will have these things first let me grab this the instance of trpc dot this we also need to import trpc here yes so trpc we don't need get user we need add user or post user dot post sample yes dot use mutation because it's the post method then that's all so when let's say this should be post data how are we passing the data that's the thing so 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 title create topic i mean this function dot mutate okay i get it so we have this post data inside we have trpc post sample use mutation this function so what we are going to do is run the function when we do this so we don't need to use this here just add post data dot mutate then we have to pass the data so it is the email which will be uh, input dot email input dot email comma password input dot password fine but i think we have some errors what is the error title is this what if we remove let me remove this thing okay so if i see here if i add as string okay this will maybe not work because now in this object input we have to add email as empty string and password also empty now this will not throw any errors fine 
Now let's give it a try and see what happens. Maybe it will work. Maybe it will not. Add the email. Let's say this and some password. Submit. We are having post sample batch equal to one. It's giving us 200 with the payload of email and password. The data is getting returned here. Desired dot data dot user dot whatever. And the data is here, I guess. Nishan, that's 440 at the gmail.com and the password. Now let me try my other email. Nishan 550 at the rate 123. Submit. Now check here. The data is here. See. So that is how we create a post method using TRPC. Post sample. Now let me also make this as get sample. Fine. If we are using this here, we have to change the get user here. Fine. Now if you open the console and go back to the index page, we will see the data as an object here with three users that I just added. I mean, we added two users and first one was from the beginning. That's how we do it.